Well hi there and welcome to Finding My Online Biz. I'm Keith A here. Today we're going to have a look at my new lighting setup. Coming right up. Okay, so you can see my new setup here. I've been trying to find somewhere in my house where I can set up a at least semi-permanent setup, a studio and finding a space in that studio, sorry, finding a space in this room that gives me the ability to do video. And so there's not a lot of space places in this room where I can do effective video. So what I've done is I've, I've got a, I've bought a $25 light from, from our Bunnings. I don't know what you call that in the States, home head hardware or something like that. Just an LED light. It was only 25 AU. So I expect that's probably only 15, 15 or $20 uh, American. Um, but it's down below here to throw a bit of light up the back. I've got a hair light here at the back with a bit of a blue gel on it just to give me a bit of definition around the, the outside of my body. Um, there's some light spilling up the side here which is fine. Mine and my wife's paintings there on the left there. And so I'm hoping to be able to do some video uh, from this position um, over the next couple of weeks and we'll see. Let me know how, what you think and I'll do a quick uh, video about the types of lights that I am using. Okay, this is my second shot at it. This time I'm using the hair light just as a light and uh, just seeing whether that makes any real difference. I think the hair light needs to go up higher. Um, at the moment though, I, there would be no way for me to get that in shot. Sorry, out of shot because it's on a stand. Um, unless I hang it from the roof, I can't imagine the boss allowing me to do that, but I can give it a go. Um, so let's just try each of these um, gels one at a time and uh, we'll see how we go. It's very windy here at the moment, so I'm copying a lot of uh, static. So I'm getting zapped every five minutes, which is really quite annoying. Um, that's that's a little bit better. Let me know what you think in the comments, of course. And if there's any other things that you can tell me, um, I've got a light over here. I'll just show you what I have. And you can see I've got one of these lights here on a stand. I've just got a park can down there. Just, um, and so, yeah, so this is, this is my setup. I'm hoping to be able to do more with this um, than I could previously. I'm not sure whether I need to come further down on these, on the actual tripod itself, so that I can sort of get it to the point where it's a really nice position. Anyway, I'm playing at the moment. Um, I'm trying to get a little bit of shade on here. I think if I turn the par can off, I might get a little bit more shade on this side of my face, uh, which might, so you can see that. So there's a light shining there, like so. I've got a light, I've got the par can shining up on the, um, just on the wall. I've got a white wall here. So on this, on this side here, I've got a white wall. So that helps me a little bit. Um, let me know what you think about the video quality, if that's better, worse, and different than what I have been doing. Um, the lights in my kitchen are great. The glitch with those is that I'm on a tile floor and the room echoes, and it echoes real bad. So this is my second test. You've seen the light that I've got up here, the hair light that I've got here. I would love to have the hair light up above and have it a bit more stronger. Uh, what do you think about the subscribe uh, with the YouTube? You can cut uh, yellow background. So I'm still working, still working. It's a work in progress. And uh, I'm hoping to do some collabs uh, coming up. Um, people who I know who've been building YouTube channels and, 
and uh, a bit more ahead than me. So that'll be coming up over the next uh, few weeks, I'm hoping. So it should be good. I'm looking forward to that. Um, so that's coming up. So I'm going to keep working on my lighting. That's not a bad setup. It needs to be quick. It needs to be easy. Whatever lighting setup you're going to use, it needs to be simple. Otherwise, you just won't spend the time to do it. It needs to be flick, 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 on. Start recording. And that's the way it, it should be. It would be really good if I had a teleprompter so that I could write a script and then follow more of a script, which would be absolutely fantastic. But we're, I'm a little bit off that yet, but I'm working on it. I tried to make my own teleprompter at one point until I realized that you need special glass to do it. And uh, so that was sort of a bit of a fizzer, that one. But it would have been fun if it had worked. Anyway, um, until next time, enjoy the journey, and I'll see you later. Bye.